Hello and welcome to this evening's edition of E-Prime. I am Daydran. Reggae Sumfest globalizing Jamaican music. The anticipation is building for Jamaica's iconic music festival, Reggae Sumfest. Organized by Down Sound Entertainment and sponsored by the Jamaica Tourist Board, JTB, the premier music festival serves to promote Jamaican music and culture, especially in light of UNESCO's designation of reggae as an intangible cultural heritage. Speaking at the Reggae Sumfest Media Appreciation Event, Director of Tourism Donovan White asserts that the Reggae Sumfest brand helps to market the destination through events, entertainment and music. We have been successful in terms of using events like Reggae Sumfest to position us in certain types of markets where music is a big part of the poll. So we are looking forward to having an increased amount of visitors coming in for Reggae Sumfest this year, partly because last year was a phenomenally big year, uh, and this year we expect it to be bigger. He teased what patrons can expect from JTB at this year's staging of Reggae Sumfest. We certainly are going to continue to try to outdo ourselves. Uh, we, we are in discussions with with some partners that we feel is we're going to be able to create some some unique experiences this year with our booth. Um, we have one of the biggest spaces on the ground and that's deliberate uh, because we not only host our VIPs and media like yourselves but we also uh, to use it as an opportunity to engage people who come to Jamaica to have a taste of of the experience that we tried to create at Reggae Sumfest. The 27th staging of Reggae Sumfest, dubbed the greatest reggae show on earth, is slated for July 14 to 20 in Catherine Hall, Montego Bay. Newfound love for popcorn. Unruly boss popcorn is showing off his musical versatility on a track dubbed Newfound Love. The song, which is a revamped cover of late reggae icon Garnick Soul's classic single, Place in Your Heart, features the firm and strong DJ flexing his singing skills on a reggae rhythm, varying from his traditional dancehall sound. The track produced by Not Nice is the first single from the veteran producer's anticipated King Midas album, which will be released on August 9. Now to news overseas where Beyonce presents The Lion King, The Gift. Disney has announced that the artist and actress Beyonce will be curating and producing a new album, The Lion King, The Gift. The album and the film's soundtrack will also include her new song called The Spirit, which was released yesterday. In an official statement, Beyonce noted that the record is a sonic cinema and a new experience of storytelling. She says it is a mixture of genres and collaborations that isn't just one sound. It's influenced by everything from hip-hop to R&B, pop and Afrobeat. She further noted that the music was not only performed by the most interesting and talented artists, but also produced by the best African producers, as authenticity and heart were very important to her. The Lion King The Gift is out July 19, along with the live-action film, which features Beyonce portraying the lioness character Nala. That's it for this evening's edition of E-Prime. I am Daydran. Thank you for watching.